What's up guys, TC here, and welcome to another episode of Starbound Inventions. Today I have a fully automatic irrigation system for crops. Now what that is, is the new uh, mechanics with farming means you now have to water your crops in order to keep them growing. If you don't water them, they stop growing. And there's primarily two ways to water them. You can use the watering pail or you can let rain do it. The other way, which was pointed out to me by a user on Reddit named Tanznuke Terror, is that you can actually run water underneath the block to uh, basically update the soil so it's it's watered. The problem is you can't just it can't just be passive water. The block has to actually update, right? So in order to do that, you'll see here this is it's actually working right now. Uh, up here I've got two turrets, and inside each turret I've got a water gun, right? So these turrets are in here, and they're aiming at this ball whenever they're on. So whenever the water level drops below this sensor, they'll turn on and they'll fire at this ball, which will refill this tank. Now it's raining out here now. But this is the whole point of this is that you don't have to build on a planet that doesn't have rain. Or you don't have to build a planet that has rain. You could build this underground or on some volcanic planet where there is no water, and you could be just fine. And so what's happening is whenever the water level drops below here, like as these crops update and they grow, they suck water out from underneath them, right? Which causes this whole little chain here to update, which eventually this tank will lower to the point where this uh, sensor turns off. And these turrets will turn on and refill it automatically. And as they grow, you're going to see on camera here, eventually they're going to grow and water blocks underneath them will disappear, which will in turn cause them to update. Now, I'll be honest with you, I'm not entirely sure. You'll see here, they're all growing right now at the same time. I'm not entirely sure why this little snake uh, effect has to be here. It's, when I do it just one line of water underneath, it doesn't seem to work consistently. So whenever I have it here, I feel like it has... Uh, it has to update further down these water blocks, and I can't quite explain why it works, but I do know that it does work, and I know that if I only had this one layer of water underneath it, that it would work only occasionally and not consistently. So, after experimenting, I found that this design here works best. And so, like I said, this is completely automatic. You don't have to do anything once you set it up. Uh, you don't have to have any rain water. Like, yes, it is raining now, but I'm not collecting any of that rain anyway. Uh, but you don't need any rain water. You never have to water your crops. All you have to do is plant them and... Uh, harvest them and that's it so uh, that's really all I have for you guys today I hope you guys enjoyed it uh, let me know if you have any tips or if you guys can figure out why the water behaves so weird like that down here but uh, that's all I got please rate like comment subscribe and I'll talk to y'all later